Hello everybody. So today I will talk about calculus. The topic today is about application of integration. So now I will show you how to answer the marginal revenue of a certain company is 500 minus 6 S dollars per unit when the production level is S units. If the income of the company is 800 US dollars when producing 8 units, what is the richest possible income from the company? So now I will show you how to answer. We know that marginal revenue just like about the R over the S equal to 500 minus 6 S and now we need to find about our S original function for revenue so if we want to do this one so we multiply both sides by the S so you got about the R equal to 500 minus 6 S multiplied by the S Next, we put the integration for the both sides. Next, the integration of the R, you got about R. The integration of 500, you got about 500S. The integration of negative 6s, you got about negative number 6. S, that's about s to the power of number 1. So you got about 1 plus 1 over 1 plus 1. And we put about c, that's about the constant. And this one is about rs. Now, we simplify this one you got about 500s this one you got about 6s square over 2 this one you got about c 6 divided by 2 you got about 3 now if the income of the company is 800 when reducing 8 units, that means when S equal to 8, so R S is about R A in here, equals to 800. So we can find the value of C, that's about the constant in here. After we put this one going here, and this one going here, So we can find about a constant. So we put this one, go to the left, and we can find the value of C. That's about negative 3008. After that, we can go about Rs equals to 500S minus 3S square minus 3008 now the question they say what is the richest possible income from the company so we need to find first the derivative of the function in here equals to the value we just do in here So we want to find the critical point of the function. So we put this one equals to number 0. So that means we have 500 minus 6s equals to number 0. And we put negative 6s go to the right. 
So we, di we divide both sides by number 6. And we got about 250 over 3. S. And now we put this one. Go back to the function. So we have the function in here. About S, we change for 250 over 3. And this one we change to, that's about 250 over 3. After we input all the values in here, and we got approximately about that's a seventeen thousand eight hundred twenty five point thirty three and US dollar, and this is the final answer. This is the end. Thank you for watching. Here is about the full answer for everything in here. We know that the unit is not about the fraction, so 250 over 3, this is approximately about 83.33. So that means number this one we round and we got about 83. So we can put about number 83 in here. And this is about 17,825.